Hey, good morning, Kurt and Katie. We are getting some insight on your rising power bills today. AEP Ohio says the extreme heat that we've been battling is part of that. But right now they are looking into how they can better use their resources to become more efficient for you. They say this drone technology is part of that. And here's a closer look for you this morning. This drone is docked at AEP Ohio's Clintonville substation. The company's drone pilots can operate this technology from anywhere. This is AEP Ohio's first drone substation, but they want to have 10 by the end of the year. Right now, they say these drones are used to conduct inspections and help identify issues to power lines before they create power problems in your home. AEP Ohio tells us in the last year, there have been about 300 instances where they have prevented an outage before it happened. They tell us they're also crucial during extreme weather events. So for storm storm response and, and damage assessment, these have been crucial. So we, we've been able to much more efficiently inspect lines, poles, looking for downed wires, broken equipment in a storm situation, find those uh, much more quicker and um, be able to get that information back to the crews to be able to make those fixes and, and get the power on quicker. As AEP Ohio implements this new technology, we're getting questions from you about rising utility bills, especially as AEP is reporting record setting profits. So I took that question to the company's local leaders. The VP of distribution operations at AEP Ohio says their parent company's revenue is different from theirs. We're capped on what we can earn on your your rates. So, you know, what our parent company earns is, is earnings that come from multiple businesses across the United States, and it's not from your bill. It's a supply and demand issue. You know, we, we are seeing increasing demand for generation and megawatts right now uh, on the grid, and uh, we're, the supply has been reduced over the past five to 10 years. Earlier this year, we told you about AEP Ohio's request to the Public Utilities Commission for an electric rate increase. If passed, the residential base rates would go up nearly $4 per month for those using an average of 1,000 kilowatt hours monthly. AEP Ohio says the base rate increase is needed to support and maintain new investments like their drone technology. The PUCO continues debating these increases. Its review process is expected to take more than a year, but it's something that we will keep watching for you and will keep you updated. On your side this morning in studio, I'm Kate Seifert for Good Day Columbus.